So next on the list is Croxacillin, okay, which is another pretty widely used um, penicillin. So famous brands in Asia include um, Ha Croxacillin and of course I've, I believe that there are many other brands but I'll just mention one. So I'm not I'm not um, related in any way to any of these drug companies. So that's a disclaimer I would like to make. So this is just this just happens to be in one of the brands that that is found in MIMS. So I'm not in any way paid by these drug companies. Okay. So for adult um, children above twenty kilograms, the dose will be two hundred fifteen to five hundred milligrams four times a day. Um, the maximum adult dose is up to 6 grams a day. Okay. So if it's 500 milligrams 4 times a day, that's about um, 2 grams. So you can at least double that. Okay. So 1 gram, so 1 gram, 1.5 grams, 5.5 um, milligram grams per day. So um, 4 times a day, that would be 6 grams. Okay. So the maximum is 1.5 grams four times a day so but don't worry too much about the maximum dose we so as um, junior doctors or um, medical students we would like to focus on knowing the, um, the the minimal dose okay as opposed to the maximum dose so for infant and children it's um, le who are less than 20 kilograms the dose will be 6.25 to 12 12.5 milligrams per kg four times a day. So for example a child who is ten kilograms so we'll be taking sixty two point five milligrams of coxacillin four times a day. So it's taken on an empty stomach. Okay. Presentation um, you can have the capsule of two hundred fifty milligrams and then we have the granules for suspension of 125 milligrams per 5 milliliters. Indications include sinusitis, okay, and then infections caused by benzyl penicillin resistant staphylococcus infections, okay, and then also bone and joint infections so when i used to work in orthopedics um cloxacillin is quite a very widely used um, drug to treat many skin infections and also other infections side effects okay pregnancy category um it's b again as with the other drugs that i've mentioned previously such as amoxicillin and ciproxime so the category is B, and unfortunately we don't have um, there are there is no available available information on um, use the usage of clopsacillin in lactating mothers. Okay, that's all for the, for for now. See you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.